A woman has been arrested linked to the retirement home theft we told you about yesterday. Police say she stole from the elderly while pretending to administer a follow-up COVID test. Fox 4's Lynn Ann Wynn has the latest from police, including an additional case. Lynn Ann. Clarice, police are still trying to figure out how long the suspect may have been doing this, but Garland police tell me that she committed a similar crime in their city and has been pawning jewelry that she stole. Now, back on September 14th, Garland police say Lakita Calhoun visited a resident at an assisted living facility, Brookdale Club Hill. According to police there, she told the resident she needed to collect a urine sample and use the distraction to steal more than $1,000 worth of jewelry from the resident's apartment. Louisville police say Calhoun works for Medical Lab Partners and used a similar story to distract multiple residents at Discovery Village at Castle Hills in Louisville last week, telling residents there they needed to be retested for COVID-19. Garland police say they were able to identify Calhoun through a pawn shop where she pawned some stolen items. We have a database in which we look into pawn shops and see if there were you know, any kind of property that had been pawned there. And that's how we were able to uh, locate her on video uh, pawning a property that did belong to our victim. Louisville police say Calhoun has confessed to the crime she committed at Discovery Village. I also spoke to one victim's grandson who says his family was able to help police identify one of his grandmother's anniversary rings from a local pawn shop, but they fear the rest of the jewelry that was stolen may be gone. Now, reps for medical lab partners say that Calhoun was fired last Thursday when police contacted them about the thefts. They say that she was a contractor that worked for them, and they say that she did not seal while conducting company business, but instead came back after hours on her own time to allegedly commit these crimes. Clarice.